Alright, hey guys, I'm back. I'm back on Diablo 3 to give you guys a heavily expensive crafting video. I'm gonna be giving you guys a good scoop on if it's worth it to craft really expensive plans. And uh, today, you know, quick details on that. I'm gonna be crafting Exalted Grand Southern Helps. Plan already is like 14 million gold, which is ridiculous. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead, go ahead and be crafting like, you know, on uh, about uh, 40 of them. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy, you know, the materials. I'm gonna need like uh, 1,400 exquisite essences. See, that's already two mil. It's probably gonna cost like, you know, six to seven mil just to craft them all with the materials and all that good stuff. I'm gonna need uh, iridescent tears. I'm gonna need 200 of those bad boys. I'm gonna need uh, 400 tombs. God damn, that's a lot of tombs, right? That's a lot of secrets I need again. It's a pretty heavy burden. I'm gonna be carrying on myself. Look at that. I had a 14 something mil already. Look at that. Just right off the bat, took off like three mil. Three mil. Got some refund for the people that undersell. Like you guys. Love you guys. Shout out to the undersellers. And uh, let's head into this game. I don't know. For some reason, I like crafting in Act 1. I guess because it's so close to the start point. So let's uh, jump in this. I know I look ridiculous, but uh, I look ridiculous. Oh, I got some leftover materials. I'll leave them over there. My infernal staff of hurting. All right, here we go, here we go. Look at all these materials. I can probably got some more materials over here. Look, damn. God damn, that's materials. So yeah, the plant costs like 14 mil. Costs like 91k just to, to craft plant so I'm gonna show and show you what it looks like to craft this many things and if it's profitable my uh, previous experiences with it is that I put around 10 million into crafting and it was actually pretty good I came out with like 14 mil that's why it was ended up 14 mil so I made like a 4 mil profit which is pretty crazy right I mean, it's pretty good uh, something to look for, you know, is in, in a helm is like critical hit chance, you know, base stats and a socket. Or critical hit chance, all resists, and a socket. Those work really well, and if it has base stat, just jump up the price more. But I'd say the best thing to look for is critical hit chance and all resist with a base stat. And if it, I mean, and, and the socket, but what I've been making a decent amount of money off of, well, gold is uh, crafting uh, gold finding helms so like let's say you get like one with like 19 and you know 20 percent gold find with a socket you put in like a 23 you know gold find gem in it people are buying that for like one mil minimum which is pretty crazy and that's pretty good to do that is pretty good to sell pretty quick i love it you guys should love it because i love it that's why you guys should love it and you guys should go out and do it right now Make some gold. Yeah, I'm sorry, this is taking forever. This guy should, he's obviously not, you know, working at a fast enough rate for me. Giving him all this money and he's not working at a, you know, decent enough rate. And I'm just, uh, oh shit, it's gonna drop on the floor, watch. Boom, boom, boom. Hold on. And let's see what the first batch has given us. Okay, these are all my previous shit ones. So you see, I craft a lot of like, these bad boys. So let's go to the first row here. So let's see. This is crap. As you can see, that's four base stats, but they're all low and it has like no really good stat on it. All right here, off the bat, 90% gold find. This I could sell, you know, for a minimum, I'd say like 650k. This is crap. I'm not gonna put the crap over here. Put this stuff over here. The good ones over there. This one has all resist, high base stat, but it needs like a critical hit chance in, or a vitality, and it doesn't have that. That's critical hit chance right here, but it's low. It has way too many base stats and no all resist and no socket. It sucks. Wow, it has one really high base stat and fit, but that's it, so that's not gonna sell. This is not gonna sell. No, no, no again. These are crap. 
And another crap one. Let's put over here. I guess we're gonna have to open a second crap folder. Jeez. 18 hours this sucks. 28 hours this. Dun, 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 dun. It has potential. It has potential. I'm gonna save that one just in case somebody, you know, put sell it for cheap. 19 gold find. 3.5. I don't believe that will sell. 18% better. You know, I can make. You know, you guys could try that as well. For some reason, magic find items are just not as quickly to sell as gold find items. It's kind of ridiculous. Guess all the gold farmers, all the gold farmers out, out there. Shout out. Shout out to you guys. And uh, this will not sell. This looks pretty sexy in the beginning, but it has no vit and has no socket. Oh, I'll keep that in mind when I go back. No good. No good. No good. Mm, 65 or is it? Oh, no good. 4% critical chance. 127 ticks. Mm, 55 hours is da, 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 da. no good, no good. Ooh, 20%, that's perfect in a sovereign. See, these are six, 62 uh, item level. At the maximum, like a 63 in Archon Helm, you get like 25% extra gold find. Those things jack up to like 2 mil. It's pretty ridiculous. Oh, this one could have been sick, but it's not. Oh, wait, there's a good one. I'm putting it over here. Silly me. Sucks. And I've seen these, so. Uh... Alright, out of the first group, we got about. One, two, three, four decent helms. Let's go craft the rest of them. How many? 14 left. So hopefully, one of these little guys right here is gonna give me some money, some big bucks. Got two socks already. Let's see what we got here. Hopefully, some gold find. Gold find with two base stats too. Damn, people love that. Our gold find with critical hit chance and base stat. Oh man, it's ridiculous. People love it. People love it. They eat it up. Let's see, let's see, let's see. We got four already. Four socketed. Still got five more to go. I'm feeling, I'm feeling lucky with this one. I feel like I'm gonna get one of those really good ones. You know, critical hit chance, all resist, socket, and a base stat. Come on, it's gonna be in there right now. I know it. Feel it. Sold one for like 6.8 mil after it cuts 4.5. It had potential. It had potential. Oh, damn it. Two swings and misses. Third, no. Fourth, no. Five, no. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Sucks. Suck it. Damn, what the fuck? What the fuck's going on here? 14 and 13. Both low, though. What the hell? Heck, man, come on. 67 hours this. Oh, no, horrible. <gasps> well, this might not. I don't know. It's taking a risk. I might save that one, see if I can get a little bit of it. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Dang. So there it is, guys. I just crafted 40 of a $14 million plan for you guys and I probably I'm, I'm, I guess I'm gonna consider this one a decent sellable helm so I made five helms with around you know six million gold I hope this was useful for you guys you guys can go ahead and try it with different plans but that's my experience and it's a really good plan and I've made a profit from it so you guys can go ahead and try it and uh, make sure to subscribe make sure to like this video share this video Help some friends out. I'm helping you guys out. Just help me out. So crap. And I'll talk to you guys later on another video.